Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make Steve. This is in size 15 cm tall. You will need all these materials and some of this embroidery color. This one. And I use a 4.0 millimeter crochet hook, a fiber fill, and if you want all detailed materials, you can find it in my description below this video. Now let's make first the foot or the leg. Form a magic ring using the gray yarn chain then half double crochet of 10 inside the ring Then for round two, half double crochet in each of the stitch. Three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then make one more round of ten half double crochet. Okay? For the round three. And once done with the round three, cut the yarn, pull up, insert your ordering needle in the second stitch, remove stitch marker, and then insert it in the back loop in the last stitch. Then hide the ends inside. Just right here. And for round four, take your blue yarn, make a slip knot, chain of eleven. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Half double crochet, second chain from the hook, then insert here on this um, foot. Insert in the first stitch and make a half double crochet. And have to bulk shade in each of the following um, stitches.
and then for the next round five single crochet in the following and use these um, ends and insert in here Then for round 6 and round 7, do a half double crochet in each of the following stages for 2 rounds. And then cut the first um, part of the leg and the other do not cut the yarn. Okay, and do invisible join. Around 8, connect the two leg and make a single crochet in the following um, 10 stitches. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then ten on the in the other side of the leg. So you will have a total of um, twenty single crochet stitches. And after that, cut extra yarn and do a invisible join. And then use the ends to um, sew in between um, leg. Now for round 9, take your green yarn and insert it in the left side of the leg, right here, okay, on this side, insert this green color and make a chain, and then add a half double crochet 
on the same in the same stitch but do not um, yarning over with the green yarn so you have three loops on your hook and take the blue yarn okay so like this yarn over three loops with the blue yarn and then continue doing a half double crochet okay half double crochet in the following including with this um, yarn tail and continue all the way around until to the 20th um, stitch Now in the 28th stitch, okay, this is the 20, yarn over, insert your hook, and you have three loops on your hook, and now change the color to this green yarn, pull through three. Okay, so normally for round 10 half double crochet with this green yarn then mark it in the next stitch do a half double crochet with the green yarn Then in the third stitch, yarn over, insert your hook, you have three loops on your hook, change to the blue yarn, pull to three, and then continue doing a half double crochet with the blue yarn until to the, all the way around until to the 28th. Um, stitch is 19 and 20 then pull through green yarn in the 20th stitch okay then now you can cut the blue yarn so we will continue first and make and place a stitch marker here so this is half double crochet for the round 11 so you mark this one and then now you can cut the blue yarn Okay, then round 11 to round 13 you just need to do a half double crochet in each of the stitch in each round and you have a total of 20 half double crochet stitches
Okay, now this is what look like after the round 13. Cut the yarn. Do a invisible join. And insert in the back loop of this last stitch. Then hide the ends. For the hand, make two of these. So take your light brown yarn, form a magic ring. Chain, then single crochet of 10 inside the ring. Then for round 2 to round 7, um, do a single crochet in each of the rounds and a total of 10 stitches. Okay, this is what look like after the round 7. Cut the yarn and do a visible join. Then for round 8, take the green yarn, make a slip knot and chain of 11. Single crochet second chain, including this brown yarn. And single crochet in the following around and then okay and then for round nine single crochet continue doing a one round of single crochet Okay, once done, um, do not cut the second arm, okay? Just cut the first one. 
and insert the second um, arm in the left side of the leg so insert the hook here and in the across the stitch here and then insert here on this side okay maybe here and do a single crochet and then do the same in the next stitch insert across the stitch and insert on the body in a single crochet so do a single crochet until to the second arm Okay, once you made it here, insert the second arm and do the same. A single crochet of four across the stitch. Then round 15, a single crochet in the following, a total of 20 single crochet stitches. Then once done, cut the yarn and do an invisible join. Now for the head or the neck, we will use the same color of the arm, the brown color. Then insert the yarn in the back loop only. So start from here with this. This is the front and this is the back loop. Okay insert this and make a slip stitch in the next
and continue doing a slip stitch in each of the stitch in the back loop only all the way around until to the um, last stitch Then after the slip stitch, it's 20, do a single crochet back loop only in the following, each of the following um, stitches. Then now for round two, do a single crochet in the first stitch and then increase in the next. Okay, repeat a single crochet in the next stitch and increase in the next and repeat all the way around till to the last stitch. Then continue doing in round 3, then round 4 to round 11. Then once you made to the round 11, this is what it look like. Now for round 12, remove the stitch marker. Single crochet in the next two stitches. One in the next second single crochet and then do a front loop in the next stitch then front loop only in the next stitch into the next stitch and yarn under pull through and yarn over pull through two and repeat a single crochet in the next two then front loop only and repeat all the way around till to the last stitch and then now continue doing round 13 to round 15 Okay, once you made it to the round 15, cut a extra yarn like this long and then we will sew the 10 front loop only stitches. Okay, once you close, 
um, you can do this is optional you can do a color or you can leave this one like this so since I'm going to show you the color so insert the darning needle like this to make the shape And by the way, once you made it here to this tutorial, um, please consider subscribe to this channel so I have the energy to make more of this like this content. And don't forget also to like this video. Okay, so and so on, you can make this color here. Okay. Then once done, just pull through the ends onto the top of the face. For the hair, form a magic ring. Then chain two. Then twelve double crochet into the magic ring. Now for round two, slip stitch in the first double crochet. Then chain of two. Then do a two double crochet in each of the stitches. And then round three, slip stitch, chain of two, double crochet into the first stitch, <coughs> and then two double crochet in the next stitch, and repeat all the way around, and you will have a 36 double crochet stitches. And then after, <coughs> slip stitch into the first double crochet, okay, chain of three, and then half double crochet second chain from the hook. One. 
to skip the next stitch here and insert into the next um, stitch so skip one and insert and then <coughs> chain of four <coughs> half double crochet second chain so one two and three then skip the next stitch insert in the next stitch and then another slip stitch so you have slip stitch of two okay and then chain six And then half double crochet of five. Then skip one stitch, insert in the next chain of nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then half double crochet in the following eight stitches. And then skip one stitch and repeat a chain of nine and then half double crochet eight and you should have total of this for eight times okay so i finish my eight times seven eight okay eight times of chain of nine and then after that we will do the same on the same side so slip stitch chain of six And then half double crochet of five. One, two, three, four, and five. Then skip one stitch, insert in the next. And slip stitch another one so slip stitch two and then chain of four half double crochet in the next three and then skip stitch make a slip stitch chain of three and half double crochet two one two and then skip stitch and slip stitch in the next okay and then make a chain and leave a extra yarn tail so we can attach the on the forehead And then now count um, five rounds on the head okay so place a pin below these five rounds so we will know where to um, make the forehead so normally this is the ears the space in between so like this okay on the following the arm and then pin this one right in the middle and also this one right here okay and then and now you can add the you can attach this one 
right on this forehead. And then now use the super glue, attach on these strands of hair, and use a pin on the edge. So glue here, and pin. Okay, this is the embroidery yarn I use for the eyes, for the nose, and the uh, mouth. Okay, I just cut a piece of embroidery yarn and I will show you. Place a pin in the center and form a box of um, the eye.
Okay, so I also made the white um, embroidery yarn and then pull through on the side of the face and then hide the ends here. Okay, so just do like that and also the nose here and the mouth like this shape. Okay, so that's it for the tutorial of Steve and if you like this video please consider to subscribe and like this video and thank you so much for watching all the way here and, and if you have any question um, let me know in the comment below and um, see you again in my next video bye